everyone welcome back to Zasha's kitchen thank you for tuning back in and if you're new to my channel welcome aboard and kindly 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 hit that notification bell subscribe you know yeah hit that notification bell to be notified whenever I upload new videos thank you so before we start please also make sure you stick to the end of the videos as I tend to give important information, tips and tricks to use in the kitchen as I go along. Sour? Good, thank you. So after creating a power smoothie for the men in my previous video, yes, I thought, you know what? It would only be fair enough if I also did something for my ladies. <laughs> So therefore today I'm going to show you how I make my weight loss smoothie especially for everyone looking to lose that stubborn belly fat. I think this smoothie is going to be one of your next best friends. Yes, so and I have to admit something else guys, this is my all time favorite weight loss smoothie, okay, because it has helped me maintain my weight also lose a little bit of weight um especially be, uh, because i'm a mother of two yes i'm a mother of two beautiful kids and ladies we know how hard it is to lose or maintain weight especially after giving birth what <sighs> it's not a joke yeah so that is why i've decided to share this recipe with you today so what um oh something else yeah i remember we're heading to a, a festive season, aren't we? Yeah, especially now, we're heading to a festive season and many of us like to indulge in all sorts of yummy foods. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we come together with families and friends and we eat and eat and eat. And then come January, what happens? The dress has gone one size or many sizes up. Whew! And I believe a lot of people what what do they do they look for shortcuts because of this rapid weight gain so they try to look for a shortcut you know weight uh, loss supplements they start taking weight loss supplements and teas well guess what i believe there's no shortcut to good things in life yeah that's my belief i don't know what your belief is so and then honestly is it not better to make your own home remedy which is healthier and good for your body and also because you know exactly what is in it yes so please let's love ourselves and give our bodies what's best after all it's only one you mm -hmm. so what makes the smoothie i'm about to share with you really effective is that it's packed with fiber yes and research tells us that foods packed with fiber and um, help keep you feel feeling full for longer oh so many herbs in that sentence oh just ignore me <laughs> yeah they help you keep full for longer and um, which obviously naturally makes you eat less which is perfect for losing weight okay so foods rich in fiber also help decrease the number of calories your body is absorbing from food so guys please try to include plenty of high fiber foods in your weight loss diet if you really want it to work okay so what i normally do is replace my dinner or my lunch with a smoothie yes yeah? so you can try doing the same or if you're really struggling just try and skip your meals, take the smoothie for a week, see if it works for you, if you're happy, and then you can continue. Uh, also, you can also try and alternate it with your meals, maybe lunch or dinner. And, and I hope it's going to work for you guys because it's been working for me, okay? So without further ado, let's get started. 
So we'll start off by putting a glass of water, a glass and a half of water in the blender. Followed by pre soaked 90 grams of pre soaked almonds. So, if you're unsure of the procedure of soaking the almonds, watch my previous video, okay? So that you can know exactly how I did it. Blend this for a minute. Then uh, we have one gram of chopped raw okra yeah now okra is biologically classified as a fruit but it's generally used as a vegetable in cooking okay yeah so it's surprising you it's um raw okra is really good for you and very nutritious with lots of health benefits and it's even better for you when you eat raw but for them um so it's got so many nutrients but the, for the purpose of this video we're just con going to concentrate um we're going to the, concentrate on the fiber in the okra. So I did freeze my okra to keep them nice and fresh. Okay, so in my previous video, I gave tips on how to freeze bananas. So okra is frozen in the same way. Okay, so you, if you're not sure how to freeze bananas, please make sure you watch my free di previous uh, smoothie, the video of the smoothie of the man, if you haven't already watched it. Okay, so back to the smoothie. We're gonna pull this. Uh, in the blender and add one diced apple so make sure you you use um, you cut your apple don't remove the seeds don't peel off the skin because everything in, a, in an apple is really nutritious okay so you want to put this in the dropped one never mind and then blend this for a minute and then I've got one avocado which is obviously rich in fiber and I've got 60 grams of pre-soaked oats And then I've got 150 grams of natural yogurt. Yeah, natural yogurt. So yogurt is rich in protein, which also helps it uh, stay full for longer. And then we're going to put four tablespoons of honey for the sweetness so if you notice you notice your smoothie is a little bit thick you can add just a little bit of water it has uh, thickened up really nice because of the okra Add a little bit of water and blend this for a minute as well. So finally we're going to add some ice cubes just to make our smoothie nice and extra cold. Voila! So this equates to almost two liters. Okay, so you can adjust the ingredients as you wish. So if you want to make it less, you can half the ingredients, all right? But this is perfect, like for a big family, okay? And as, also you can take it, you can have as a to-go breakfast or a snack. Ooh, look at that. Looks really delicious. You can have it in the morning, as I've said, for breakfast or a quick on the go breakfast if you're going to work mm. very delicious i must admit i love it it's my favorite smoothie anyway so i always love the way it tastes you can taste a little bit of the okra not really 
but the taste is quite far and the avocado and the yogurt and everything okay mm. it's also a very nutritious and delicious snack so instead of snacking on healthy and un unhealthy things like crisps, sweets i don't know what you know you you can have the smoothie instead so if you're planning your new re year's resolution and weight loss is one of them well then i think this smoothie is a perfect starter okay i think it's perfect for that weight loss journey and i hope guys you have enjoyed the recipe you have enjoyed watching the video please do leave a comment and share with us how you have managed to lose weight or how you've managed to maintain your weight after childbirth or just in general okay so i believe everybody has their own tricks this is my trick there you have it guys so if you do make the smoothie as well do let us know how it's working for you just keep us updated on your journey that would be great to know so thanks for watching please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already as um, i have many more healthy treats in store for you okay so until next time it's bye for now and thank you Cheers!